Hey you, do you want to win some free Robux? Well, I give away Robux every single day. To enter, like the video, subscribe to the channel, comment down below your Roblox username, and set up a please donate booth, and you'll be entered. So here we are right now inside the legacy piece. I'm going to be showing you guys a full beginner guide of the game. I'll also be telling you guys all of the fruit locations that um, will help you guys get your first few fruits in the game right now. So far, for everybody, let's go into it. But if you are ever in need of Robux and have a computer, go ahead and check out RBX Idol. This program allows you to earn Robux, gift cards, and more with simply a computer. This program has over 100,000 downloads and has already given out millions of Robux to a lot of players. All you have to do is go to the website and click on the download button, or you can follow how I'm doing it on screen. You can earn with any computer, and there is tons of ways to get prizes such as Robux, gift cards, Steam, Discord, Nitro. You can level up for rewards or win prizes in Gold Rush giveaways. Once you have the program ready and downloaded, you guys can click on Start Earning, and this will make your computer do the work completely for you. To get started, head to rbxidol.com or click on the link down below in the description and pinned comment. See so yeah, guys, this game just came out. It's another one of these like one piece uh, one piece Roblox games right now, guys. And I'm going to be telling you everything that you need to know. It's like a little bit of a starter guide over here, guys, in order to, I guess, progress throughout the game as quick as you possibly can. So first of all, guys, um, you're going to want to be doing some quests over here. Because quests are going to help you guys level up a bit faster and all that sort of stuff. Now, also, you will find these crystals in some areas of the map that allows you guys to set your spawn. So, I, I would recommend to, to set your spawn wherever you want to just stay, guys. But, yeah, for example, guys, the people that have the exclamation marks above their head, that um, the, their quest, guys. There's a bunch of quests in total in this game. Um, so, for example, guys, well, we don't have um, enough level levels to, to do that quest guys but yeah all the ones with like the yellow um exclamation marks they are quests guys and um, we also have these blue quests over here um as well which will tell us to do things such as deliver messages now where do we go if we need to deliver messages messages guys well it'll show you with that little um exclamation mark guys and then you just like talk to to, to the people i guess um and I guess you just keep on progressing within the game like that. So what other things do you guys need to know in the game, guys? Well, I'm, I've done all this yesterday, so I'm quite confused right now. But anyway, if you guys follow me, you'll be able to go in and spawn in some boats around here, guys. So pretty much over here is the um, boat dealer, the ship sailor right there. And you guys can actually buy these boats in with belly right now. There's, currently, um, there's quite a lot of ships in the game over here, guys. We can spawn those in over there. Another thing, guys, is that you can also go ahead and, well, in this game, it's not where, um, it's not where, like, you, you get stat points and stuff, guys, and you spend them. It's actually to do with mastery, guys. So, as you can see at the bottom here, I'm faced mastery level 3. The more mastery you guys have, the, the more damage your guys will do. So, yeah, it's not a stat-based game, guys. It's a mastery game. Um, the based game. So just keep that in mind, guys. You're not going to really be spending your stats over here. And what all else is there for you guys to do in the game? Well, if you guys come over here to this shop right now, you guys can buy a bunch of items. So you guys can buy a health potion, um, a stamina potion, and also some other stuff over here, guys. You can also buy weapons right now, as you guys can see. Um, so yeah, there's a lot of things that you guys can buy in that shop, which are quite cool too. Now, um, that is essentially all I have for like the beginner guide over here. Now let's go ahead and get on into the method of getting fruits. So hey guys, how can you get fruits? Well, there's currently only one method in the game right now to go ahead and get fruits. And that is by simply finding them underneath trees. They're going to be spawning underneath trees, guys, every, I'd probably say like 10, 15 minutes, I guess. Now, um, there is currently no like fruit gacha i'm pretty sure guys you can't like buy them at a fruit dealer or whatever you pretty much just have to find them underneath trees guys um literally they can be at any tree in the game um that's why i'm not really going to show you guys every specific location but yeah literally guys they can be in every single tree and every single tree in the game guys and if you want to find them just have a little look around now there's an even easier way of doing so you guys can go to the shop if you guys have the Robux, you guys can go ahead and get the fruit notifier over here. That'll uh, that'll um, bring you guys to the fruit whenever one spawns in. So, yeah, that's another way of going ahead and getting those fruits, guys, a bit easier. If you don't want to have to look around the map for a very, very long time. But other than that, guys, that's pretty much the full beginner guide for Legacy Piece in the game over here. I think that's going to be it for the video. So, like and subscribe for more.